Hey guys, welcome back to Vila Hana Soul TV. I'm so sorry I didn't get to vlog last week. I was deadly sick. Someone, they didn't read the sign. No cough, zone, A. Hey, no cough, zone, uh. You know better, what? You know better. For real though, because I got sick and I was on my deathbed for about a week and a half. I had to stay home from work, it was so tragic. What you got Wednesday this week? I thought I'd do kind of like a mix with like a hair video. I'm not a hair blogger by any means, I just watch them on YouTube. But I've kind of developed a little routine with three products that I really enjoy using. My nighttime routine, I had already washed and conditioned my hair, well, shampooed and conditioned my hair. And then after I get out the shower, I use a t shirt to dry my hair. And then uh, the next thing I do is my Kinky Curly Knot Today. This is com like, look, I have a little bit left. And uh, yeah, so I use that on my hair. It really, like, if this detangles it, you could just finger detangle your hair and use this product and it's, you're already halfway done. I'm uh, taking a little bit of that, putting it into my hands, kind of swishing it together and applying it to my hair. As I take my wide tooth comb and I just, you know, detangle it, comb it out from uh, the top down to the root second. Next, I start to twist my hair. I just do a two strand twist. I think the harder journey is actually going natural, is researching your products, looking for organic uh, things. I think that was the good thing that I saw in the Kinky Curly Knot today is it is has organic ingredients that you put in your hair and the fact that you can get that at Target. I'm done twisting up my hair. I put on my purple do rag, you know, and then I'm ready for bed. A little do rag off. Say, oh my goodness, it's flattened. And then I start to like finger, finger detangle the twist and kind of get the twist out. And it's so cute when you see all your cute little like curls and things happening. So that's what I'm doing there is I'm detangling, getting all of that out. So one uh, personal issue I have with my scalp and my hair is I had like hair falling out and I think it was from like heat and uh, uh, heat damage and chemicals. So that's kind of why I started to take this, well that's actually completely why I took this natural journey was because my hair was falling out. I was balding at 21, 22. Keep that between me and you and whoever else is going to watch this video, hopefully millions. But. So I uh, found this cool company called Fig and Yarrow and they actually had a clearance sale because I was kind of waiting on this product because it was a little pricey uh, but it's a hair tonic and so what it does is it helps you know moisturize your scalp and promote hair growth so I've actually been using it for maybe about a month now and I love it. It has organic products and essential oils, it has a little beaker there where you can just put it right onto your scalp and then you massage it into your scalp and work it up into your hair. So I do this probably twice a week, twice to three times a week if I, like with this winter time I do it more often because my scalp has just been getting really dry. So yeah, the hair and scalp tonic at Fig and Yarrow. So after I'm done with that and working that in, I grab my Lush R&B. And this one I get the most um, compliments on as far as smell. And then uh, I let them try it out and people love it in their hair. And the good thing about it is it's for coarse curly hair, but anyone, like you, like anyone can use it. Like another uh, product with organic ingredients and essential oils and all kinds of fun things to read off of it. And it actually has an expiration date. And in my mind, if it has an expiration date, I feel like that means like it's really legit. Like if things are gonna go bad in your product, it must be good for your hair. Now, that's not a doctor's note, that's just me, so don't quote me on that. But you know what I mean. All right, so this is what my hair looks like at the end of the day. Uh, still moisturized at the scalp. You can still feel the moisture in my hair. It has, you know, the nap. Like your hair is gonna feel dry with natural hair, but 
you know the different types of dry. There's like a, I haven't moisturized my hair in years dry and then there's the oh okay the oils are on there it's just got its own fun natural hair dry. You'll know. Take the journey and you'll figure it out. But I hope that you guys like this What She Got Wednesday. It was kind of a spur of the moment thing but all the links will be in the low where you can find the products and yeah I hope you liked it. Bye guys. So like could you just like and subscribe?